Okay, so what I was saying was, it's been a very busy day today. I am in traffic right now, so I thought it would be a good time to update and to say hi and hi, and to update on what I'm do what I was doing, what I just did, and what I will be doing for the rest of the day. Um, so I went to nanny this morning. Actually, this afternoon I nanny at 12 till about two, a little after two, and that went good. I put down the girls for their nap and. Then I took care of some planning for this week, and I was asked to be a lifeguard for um, this thing that I'm a part of. It's called Girls Camp. Because <clears throat> um, I don't know if anybody knows this, but I used to be LD, or I'm um, technically inactive LDS, and I haven't gone in a while, but I really loved the girls camp aspect of it and so being asked to be like the lifeguard and they said that they'll like pay for the training and everything awesome so i'm gonna i'm gonna do that in august i'm really excited for that yay and so i got that into my schedule i was thinking about it i agreed to do it and my mom said that i'm a pretty neat girl for doing it yay for putting myself out there and Yay, I'm excited. And, um, hmm, what else? What else did I do? And then I did some coloring, as you guys probably saw, and I don't remember anymore. I just did some planning, just sat on a chair on my butt, did a bunch of planning, and trying to work in my new job into my schedule and trying to um, plan out my my movie theater schedule so that's been that's been good I have decided that instead of taking the semester off from century 16 I am just going to work Saturday and Sunday nights hold on one second retainer is giving me a lisp. Instead of just taking the semester off from Century 16, I'm going to just work Saturday and Sunday nights only because um, I have the new retirement plan paper. I got accepted into a retirement plan through Century 16 just a few weeks ago, finally, and so I am gonna put probably, probably everything that I earn from this semester into my retirement account. Yay! I'm excited to be getting that started. I was, I actually just ran into one of my coworkers from because I was just at work right now to change my availability and stuff, I ran into one of my coworkers, super sweet, has worked here for a while, and she said that she's got her retirement plan up and running too, and she's actually had a really good experience with it, so that's exciting. Yay! Um, so I'm super excited to get this account started. I may do that tonight while I'm at school. I got a lot to do at school. I got like a um, a transfer meeting, a, a four-year transfer meeting today. I don't have to go to it, but I'm going to a four-year eventually, and I'm transferring there. Um, so it'd be nice to get some details on that. Also, um, I will be filling out a breastfeeding class form so I can go to a breastfeeding class in March. And then I have math homework to do. And then I'll get that retirement stuff. Well, luckily I'll be there. I'll be at that at school from 5-ish, 5.20-ish till like 9. So I've got a good solid four hours to do all this stuff. So what better time? I don't have class yet. I'm just there for Tegan's class. So anyway, I'm sort of just rambling, but I'm also giving a lot of updates and things that are going on. It's all really good stuff. 
stuff and I'm really excited and kind of scared at the same time, you know, but it's all good change and it's all being registered, it's all sitting well with me and it feels good. So I'm going to go home right now, I'm on my way home and traffic is picking up, so I'm going to go home and pick up my brother. school to be there on time. Uh, so, <laughs> that'll be good. So we can just hang out. I may just get a head start on the work I have to do tonight. It wouldn't be a bad idea. So, thanks for sticking in, if that's the phrase. You know, like, for listening for this whole thing <laughs> and I hope it inspires you too to um, do some good stuff for yourself I promise you won't regret it so do it <laughs> anyways I'll talk to you guys soon bye hey guys so our Christmas tree is still here, so ignore the bed, but our Christmas tree is still here. It is about the middle of February, and we just put our Christmas tree outside, basically. This thing is massive. This thing's like 16, 17 feet. <sighs> I got a really good deal on it, though, and it was a really great tree, so it's just kind of out here. Dying. So sad, but I wanted to take a moment to to uh, say goodbye to the tree. <laughs>